We do not expect harmful levels of radiation to reach the West Coast, Hawaii, Alaska, or U.S. territories in the Pacific. That is the judgment of our Nuclear Regulatory Commission and many other experts. Furthermore, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and public health experts do not recommend that people in the United States take precautionary measures beyond staying informed. And going forward, we will continue to keep the American people fully updated, because I believe that you must know what I know as president. Blatant fucking lie. Blatant fucking lie. Slow genocide. And now, finally, the lamestream media, after two years, picks up the story. ABC, San Diego, and MSN, both telling us that, well, let's see, infants born soon after nuclear disaster were 28% more likely to develop congenital hypothyroidism, which can lead to stunted growth. Stunted growth? Yeah, stunted it in the mid-20s by death. Okay? But still they try to spin it. There's still no direct evidence those radiation levels can harm humans. Well, wait a minute. If you just told me that one-third of the children won't grow as big as they should have grown, that, that's evidence. That, that's, okay, bull fucking shit, people. Blatant fucking lie. And his lie is equal to genocide. Enough people will die because of Fukushima and because they were not informed that they should stay out of the rain, that they should change their diet that they should do things like bentonite clay and other ways to detox the body. Not let the children play in the snow, unfortunately. Yeah, it sucks, but you got to make these changes or your children are going to die. He blatantly lied to you. If you want to believe the, the greatest country in the world and with all the, the resources and all the science that we had, that he honestly thought that everything was fine when Fukushima blew up? Bullshit! If you think that, you damn well better review yourself because you're going to be the target of one of his next lies that could lead to your death or full economic collapse or what, what... Anyway, it's just one more reason to arrest this son of a bitch. His lie was blatant. He had the information he had to have. Many of us did. Many of us knew. You don't, you don't have to have any science. Radiation kills. We know that. We can't argue that fact. And nuclear reactors blew sky high. With Some of them with MOX fuel, which for you that don't know is even more deadly than regular nuclear fuel. And you don't expect any harmful levels... Let me tell you something, when almost 30% of the children are stunted from growth, that alone is enough. But it goes way beyond that, folks. Those, those same children are going to die from the fallout from Fukushima. And in here isn't stated how many children were stillborn. Where are those facts? Because they're out there. Infant death rates uh, within three months of Fukushima spiked. 17% on the west coast, 35% on the east coast. Follow the jet stream. This man needs to be arrested immediately. And you need to inform yourself. The link to my website will be below where you can get some of the most recent uh, radiation updates and make sure you check out these guys that have their finger on the trigger of this every day. Also, natural detox. Learn how to uh, protect yourself. Implement some diet, habit change, folks. Because if you don't do it, and if you don't make your kids do it, they're going to be a statistic. And they're going to die. And it's as simple as that. Anyway, the link to the uh, e, e News post will be below. And the uh, link to the website will be below. Much love, many thanks, and also 
the petition to arrest this son of a bitch that does not care about you or your children. And you've got to put your body upon the gears and upon the wheels, upon the levers, upon all the apparatus, and you've got to...